Hey everybody, welcome to the party. I'm so excited that you're here. Let me give you just a brief overview of some of the things that Jamberry offers, and then I'm going to show you how we apply and remove a wrap so you can see just how easy this process actually is. So here's our wraps. They come in these cute little packages. They have the instructions to apply and remove them on the back so you never lose those. They are heat activated, pressure sealed vinyl wraps. So what that means is that you can have up to two weeks of gorgeous nail art on your fingernails or up to six weeks of fabulous nail art on your toes because since they're vinyl, they're not going to chip and they're not going to smudge. You don't even have a dry time. Once you put them on, bam, you're done. You walk away. You get interrupted in the middle of something. No problem. You get up, you take care of it. You come back and you finish your nails. They're amazing. Next, let me show you this little heater here. This is our little mini heater. It's what we use to apply the wraps. It provides the heat source that you need in order to get a really good seal. Remember I said they are heat activated pressure sealed. You need that heat in order to activate the adhesive. So this is fabulous, totally worth its weight in gold. You can use a blow dryer, you can use a rice bag, you can use a space heater, but nothing works as well as this mini heater. It just provides a very consistent amount of heat, a very high level amount of heat, and it helps you get things done very quickly, hands-free because you're not holding on to anything like you would with your blow dryer, and you don't have to worry about it producing ionized heat like a lot of blow dryers do. Okay. We also have these cute little bags. These are our application kits. They come with everything you need to be able to get a perfect application every time. You're gonna get some alcohol wipes, you're going to get all of the supplies that you need to apply your wraps. Everything fits right back inside this bag. And watch this. It also fits the mini heater. The cord actually detaches and comes off. Doesn't create any extra space and your wraps fit in here too. So when you're ready to go and do your manicure, all you have to do is grab this bag and you're ready to go. You can get it with our nail oil or you can get it without totally your option. Whichever you want to do, the nail oil is pretty incredible and totally worth the price. If you are going to be wearing your wraps consistently, it gives you a really good nourishment to your nails that help them to stay healthy and strong. We also have our cuticle oil in a pen, so you can apply it really quick on the go. You just click the bottom and rub it right around your cuticle there. It's really, really convenient. We also have a lacquer remover, which is so fabulous for getting your wraps off. I'm going to show you how well it works when we take one of mine off and put the other one on. We also have a nail cleanser, which you can use before you apply your wraps instead of using an alcohol wipe. Let me show you how to put one of these on. Ready? Okay, first I'm going to show you how we take one off just because I already have a full manicure done. So I actually open up my, um, my lacquer remover bottle here. And I pour just a little bit into a medicine cup. If you have kids in your house like I do, you probably have 500 of these things floating around. Okay, I'm going to take my orange stick and I slide it right under the side of my wrap. I don't know how well you can see that, but I just slide it right under the edge of it there towards the bottom of my nail. I put my nail inside this cup with the lacquer remover and I sort of just wait a few minutes to let it do its thing. The lacquer remover is really strong and... As you can see, with very, very minimal pressure, I sort of just let the orange stick sit there. It will just come right off. Okay, and it kind of like, you can see how it just sort of eats up that wrap. I don't know, maybe you can't, but it's great. Great and quick and effective, and it leaves my nails looking fabulous without destroying them. Okay, next I'm going to grab our our nail cleanser here and I'm just gonna pump the top of it here you generally would want to use a cotton ball like and just pump it um, but I don't have any so um, what you do with that is you're just gonna rub it on your nail it's gonna work as the same as like an alcohol wipe or um, alcohol on a rubber cotton ball would do probably like you've seen in a lot of other application videos and it just takes that off right there takes all the oil off right there. Make sure that your nails get dry and since I'm only doing one I'm just going to shake it a little bit to make sure that it does before we go and put the next one on. So what I'm going to do is take my orange stick and I'm going to use the other end because this is still wet from um, when we took my wrap off. But I'm just going to push my cuticle back. Generally of course you want to use the other end. It's a little bit easier. 
Usually I've got time for that to dry out because I'm not just doing one nail at a time. <laughs> okay, then I am going to, this is the next wrap I'm going to put on. So generally this is going to come on a whole sheet, so it's a little bit easier, but I'm going to peel back the plastic here and then I'm going to do my best to not actually touch the wrap with my finger. It will transfer oils to it, which is really the last thing that you want because then it won't stick to your nail. I cut it in half. I'll just set that aside for later. I'm going to turn on my mini heater, which I don't even know if you can hear this. That's how quiet it is. And I heat it for just a couple of seconds. Not really for very long, especially because this heater is really powerful. And I'm just going to place it on my nail. Now, since I can't really do this while I'm holding it up and show you at the same time, I'm just going to kind of show you and then put my hand down to do it. So I'm going to set it right next to my cuticle as close as I can there. And then I'm going to lay it down across my nail. So I'm going to heat it up. Like I said, I set it right next to my cuticle here. And then I just lay it down across the rest of my nail. Now I'm going to take my finger and put pressure from the base of my cuticle up to my nail, up to the tip of my nail. I'm going to take that um, cuticle pusher off and then I'm going to rub it the rest of the way. So I'm going to start again, base of my nail to the tip, but I'm just going on the sides. And then I'm going to go back and forth across the whole thing. Okay, now I'm going to heat it again. Heat activated, pressure sealed. Remember, that's the trick. So I'm going to heat it up heat it and I heat it until I can feel the heat from whatever heat source I'm using coming through my fingernail. So I don't want to hold my hand so close that it actually burns the skin around my nail. I don't want my rice bag so hot that it burns the skin around my nail, but I want to leave it there long enough that I can feel the heat coming from the heater coming through my fingernail. That way I know that it has been, it has activated the adhesive and my nails even warmed up a little bit to receive the wrap. Okay. Now I take my nail file. You're going to need to use a rough grit or a tough grit nail file, um, heavy duty grit, whatever they're called. <laughs> um, and you're going to go down at a 90 degree angle and you're actually going to press a little bit on your nail and tear straight down. Okay. You don't want to go side to side, back and forth, um, which I guess is the same thing <laughs> or up because it will take the grit from your nail file and put it underneath your wrap and that won't help it bond to your nail at all. So you're just gonna rub it right here. Always think about pulling the wrap towards your nail. Every time you pull that um, nail file against your wrap, you're gonna pull the wrap towards your nail. And you can see how it just tore off right there. It just ripped straight through the vinyl. And now, done. Okay, so hop back over to the event. We're gonna finish the party up on Facebook. Thanks for watching the video. I hope it was helpful to you and I will see you back on Facebook.